What's up, everybody? So, I was talking to a friend of mine, and I wanted to make note of something. He's a Jets fan. I was fucking with him because he's wearing a, a, a Jets jersey in one of his pictures. And I told him that it, that it should be a Giants jersey, whatever, whatever. Anyway, so we got to talking, and he's like, well, I know you ain't one because I grew up with you. He's like, but ever since the two Super Bowls, or as I like to call them, 2007 fans, uh, there's been a huge influx of fucking bandwagon fans. So if you got any of you motherfuckers out here watching this video, I'm going to tell you, okay, like if you just started to like football and you like the Giants after our Super Bowl, that's acceptable, that's okay, you know, but if you were someone who claimed to be like, fo like claimed to like football before, or you're a two-teamer or a team hopper, get the fuck out of here, get the fuck out of here with that shit, don't fucking... Rewrapping Big Blue. Sorry. Reason being is, we got the best fucking fan base in the entire NFL. We do. Big Blue. Us. If you can't tell me who Joe Pasarczyk, Otis Anderson, Jeff Hostetler, Mark Bavaro, Mark Ingram, fucking Phil Sims, you better be able to tell me who Phil Sims is. Uh, fucking Lawrence Taylor, Carl Banks, you don't know who they are? You can't tell me who they are without fucking Googling them? Jersey off, get the fuck out of here. Go, go to an expansion team. Go to a team like the Baltimore Ravens or Jacksonville, the Jacksonville Jaguars that don't have that much history, and go, go fucking deal with them. Don't come over to Big Blue with that shit. I don't know, man. I can't fucking... No Giants fan. No real Giants fan. He's gonna have a fucking ounce of respect for you. And we, and we shouldn't. If you're gonna do some shit like that, then in years like this, then in years like this, you're not truly gonna be a fan of us. And I don't know about you, but... I don't have very many friends that are Giants fans. I don't really have very many friends. I don't deal with too many people. And that's okay. But those of us who I am friends with, who are Giants fans, you know, we're real fans. We know. And I can tell a fake fan from a real one just within a few minutes of you talking. Take that shit somewhere else. Take it to another team. Don't be the fucking... A fucking EDP of the Giants because we don't want you. I have zero respect for any fucking fair weather of any team, but especially of mine. See, because to me, football isn't just a sport. Okay? Anybody who knows me knows I came from a bad neighborhood. Football was was something that kept me out of doing dumb shit. Was something that helped me keep my life straight during the point in time where I was fucking doing shit that you know I was kind of teetering on what I was gonna turn into. That's why when people insult me, okay, but like, you don't know where I came from. You don't know my life. So, for someone on YouTube, that's why the YouTube trolls like you, Scott Fellas, you don't bother me. Everything I put on the internet, I know people are going to use it against me. That's why A-bomb, that's why you don't bother me. You can't hurt my feelings, bro. You can't. And none of you motherfuckers know this, but like, where I came from and how I came about, how I grew up. I came a lot farther than any of you motherfuckers that I will not ever know. And football is one of the things 
that helped me stay alive to this point. <laughs> so when someone comes in, I mean, I love other sports too, but football has a special place in my heart. And there's one team, there's one team that fills that, that, that space. And it's the New York Football Giants. I don't give a fuck if we go 0-16 for the next 10 fucking years. I mean, I do. I will still rep Big Blue. And for any of you motherfuckers out there, false flagging or fucking being Fairweather fans, fuck you. Take it to another team. Take it somewhere else. Or preferably don't do it. You Giants fans that are 2007's fans aren't Giants fans. You're winning franchise fans. You're Super Bowl fans is what you are. But you're not a Giants fan. And anyone like like me, NYG Man Joe, Hitman313, fucking Bones NYG, Mr. Bad Dog, Stork Prime, fucking Rayvon from Virginia, all of us. Pint 1980, uh, Pint 1998. We know it. Within a minute of talking to you, motherfuckers, we know it. So you're not putting on no act for someone that is gonna believe you, that thinks that you're really a fan. You're putting on an act for other people who don't know this team like we do. So if you're a Fairweather fan and you see this video, and fucking sell your shit on eBay, take it to the pawn shop, do whatever you want to do. But take it off, don't put it back on, and go fucking rep another team or become a real fan, preferably, of anybody else. But don't false flag on my fucking team, because I take that personally. Scott, you could say, oh, why is football that important to your life? We've already established in the comments that just because I don't live life like you do, you think that's awkward. That's great, I'm a different person than you. I'm a different person than you. But the beauty of America, living in this country, one of the few things that we still have a right to, is you can live your life the way you want, and I can live mine the way I want. The way you live your life, sure as fuck wouldn't make me happy. I mean, I actually have to work. I actually go to work and make a paycheck. I couldn't sit off a woman and fucking have a woman support me like you do. But that's up to you, that's your life. That's not mine, I don't have to live with what you do. You do have to live with what you do. You don't have to live with my choices. I do. Just because you disagree with my life doesn't mean I'm gonna change for you, motherfucker. It's my life. I do what the fuck I want. So don't like, I know you're gonna be like, well, it's just football. It's not just football to me. And you might not agree with that, you don't have to. But for someone like me, what football has meant, and specifically what the New York football giants have meant, it is personal to me. So fuck you too. Because I know you're gonna come on here with some smart ass comment, so I'm just letting you know ahead of time. Fuck you, later.